Hello and welcome to Shot Waters News Now. I'm Bass Barker and I'm here to bring you all the latest news around Shotwater High School. We have many new faces this year on campus. Some of these faces include Miss Giannis. I sat down with her last week to discuss her start at Shotwater. Hello, my name is Bays Barker and today I'm with Miss Giannis. And today she is a new teacher at Shotwater School. And so Miss Miss Giannis. What brings you to Shawwater? There was a teaching position open for one. <laughs> That's why I got here. But honestly, um, I've been waiting for over 30 years to come back to this area. And it just, life happened. So I live by the coast. That's where I'm, I live. And this job was open. So I came and it, you know, it happened. That's awesome. Did you grow up around here? Actually, no. I came to Texas Tech. Guns up, everybody. Yeah. You know, and, um, you know, so I came to Tech. It was fun. The people were great. Uh, the people that I worked with were great. And then, you know, I got married, and then we left. And mm -hmm. so I've been trying to get back ever since. Well, that's pretty cool. Um, have you enjoyed being here so far? Yes, I'm so excited. Yes, and y'all have a great school. I've taught in a lot of places. I've taught for 30 years. So this is my 31st year, and I am just so happy. My heart is full, and there's not more I can say. I'm just that excited. Man, that is awesome. That's good to hear. Um, now I'm going to ask you your personal question. What is your favorite restaurant? Um, hmm. My favorite restaurant. My favorite restaurant in Lubbock mm -hmm. or anywhere? Anywhere. Anywhere. Okay. Well, in Lubbock, it used to be something called Whistling Dixie. They don't have that anymore. It used to be a barbecue place. It was mm -hmm. all you can eat of whatever. And uh, yeah, they don't have that anymore. So that saddens me. But um, if I have a favorite one, um, I would say maybe there's one. I can't remember the name. I'm trying to remember. I, I want to say it's called Picantes. Mm -hmm. But I do like Chewies, oh, yes. <laughs> you know, or something like that, but kind of in those lines, yeah. Well, those are great restaurants. Thank you for coming out. I really hope you enjoy it here. Thank and you. And thanks for coming you out. You are very welcome. Thank All you. Right. It's great to have Miss Giannis at Shallow Water. Two Shallow Water students recently achieved an AP Scholar Award. Both were seniors, Porter Bellum and Aiden Rideout, were both awarded the academic achievement for scoring three or higher on their AP exam. Whew. Let's go guys, congratulations. Homecoming week has been a blast at Shawwater High School. Each day has been a different theme and there was also a homecoming mini float parade in the halls. On Wednesday night, the homecoming bonfire took place and it was a great turnout. Homecoming week is always a great tradition at Shawwater. Another new teacher this year is Miss Woody. She is teaching biology, and we recently talked to her about her new job at Shallowater High School. I'm here with Miss Woody, and I'm going to ask her a few questions. Miss Woody, yes. What school did you come from? So I came from a school outside of San Antonio, known as Lavernia ISD. Okay. <laughs> what college did you go to? Okay, so I went to Lubbock Christian University. How many years have you been teaching? This is my second year teaching. And how are you liking Shallow Water so far? I'm loving Shallow Water so far. I love how we are incorporating Christ and involving the community in everything that we do. And what's your favorite food? Um, I would say my favorite food is steak and baked potatoes.
Thank you. See you next time. I'm Gary Boschman with your Shallow Water Sports Network report. The Phillies and Mustangs have both been busy to start off the school year. Cross country, football, tennis, and volleyball are all underway, and all squads are competing at a high level. Cross country will compete at the Oil Patch Invitational at Sundown High School on Saturday. This will be their sixth meet of the year and their final tournament before district starts on October 7th. Ten the tennis team has had a great season so far. They are currently 11 and 9 with one more match before a by district play. They will compete at Level N on October 1st. Philly Volleyball currently sits 21 and 11 on the year and have had some intense matches so far. They will begin district play this Saturday against the Tulia Lady Hornets. The match will be at Shallowater High School. JV starts at 11 and varsity at noon. Come out and support the Phillies. The Mustang football team sits at 2-2 two two on the season after some tough games with some fierce competition early on in the season. Tonight will be their homecoming game against the Idaloo Wildcats. Kickoff is set for 7 p.m. at Todd Field. Let's take a look at the game day forecast with lead meteorologist Blaine St. Clair. Blaine St. Clair here on your game day forecast. Today's weather will be 87, sunny with zero chance of rain and then 7 miles per hour wind and perfect weather for Smash Mouth football. Well, that's all today, folks. Thank you for joining Shawwater News Now. Tune in next week for all the latest news around Shawwater High School and let's go be out of here.